YouTube, what is good today is Tuesday. Not the most orders right now, but it's okay. We packed up a lot of stuff from Saturday. We still got a decent amount of stuff. Most notable here, obviously gotta be these Gucci loafers. Don't ask how, but we sold these. Other than that, we got two nice authentic jerseys, the Zach Thomas helmet tag and the Carmelo Anthony with the tags. Two pairs of Jordan 13s, which is interesting, both lightly used. And thankfully, we sold this pair of the Supreme 96s because I feel like this is just a bad investment and a terrible sneaker with the see-through. Speaking of bad investments, we also sold the Supreme Teddy Bear. I think I paid 200 for this when it came out and I ended up selling it for like 196. So whatever, gonna take that small L and turn it into a W. And Jordan can talk about some of the other stuff that's sold other than this classic hat, cause I know he doesn't want to talk about how nice this cap is. But I, this is a very I nice cap. I give it to you. The Eagles do have a nice, you know, throwback logo. They do, they do, I gave that to you. Yeah, not like you said, like Tuesday's usually pretty crazy, but again, it's not like a crazy amount of stuff today, but there are some gems in here. Like that Zach Thomas is really, Really, really nice. I really like that jersey. Just the way the Miami Dolphins just have a really, really nice jersey. A lot of people forget like that jersey has navy in it, and you can tell like it looks black, but it has navy. So that 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 tailish, greenish, the orange, the navy is really, really nice jersey. With the helmet tag. Cannot forget the Kobe's. You know, you know, R.I.P. to Bean. That's a really good basketball shoe. The I.E. Low Space Jam. So really nice. Flint 13. Michigan Dunks literally sold earlier today. You know, selling more uh, mosaic boxes or the mosaic. Yeah. I may be wrong, but again, like you saw the Gucci loafers, I've been here for like at least like seven months, eight months. I know exactly who sold us those. Good guy. The Supreme Bear, like he said, it was, you know, bad investment again. Not the biggest loss. So basically that money back and invest in something else. Also, we do read all the comments. Shout out to my fellow Chicago Bear fans who held it down in the comments. We got the Rams this week. We're going to beat the Rams. Fingers crossed. Hopefully, probably lose. But again, shout out to my Bears fans who um, supported me with A through the lanyard. So other than that, we do buy sneakers. Everyone calls and says, you guys buy sneakers. We do buy by sneakers so yeah all right so we got another order the crimson tints this shoe surprisingly does pretty well for us in a weird way only used though just came in today literally as we were packing i don't know where it's heading probably like somewhere on the east coast but again decent shoe should have cleaned up the bottoms a little bit probably would have got a couple more dollars out of that but again still a good sale english is definitely look good on these but again it's an ugly shoe so we're gonna box these up and get it ready to ship with this stuff so and then sadly, speaking of Air Jordan 1s, obviously we ship out so many orders per week. Sometimes there's bumps in the road. In this particular case, uh, we had a buyer open up a claim against us for a sneaker that he purchased on July 27th. Sadly, we're checking tracking. After it hit the Newark Distribution Center on July 28th, it disappeared. RIP to that shoe. RIP to that money that we got for that shoe. Hopefully, you know, we'll get some money back during the claims process. You know, it sucks because we had no idea this happened until the buyer brought it to our attention. Obviously, we figure everything we send out arrives at the destination it's supposed to arrive at, but sadly, sometimes this happens. I'd say one every like 400, 500 pairs we sell, we have this type of issue where the shoe just kind of disappears. Hopefully it pops up, but July 28th, what's today? September like 7th? Yeah, it's a wrap for those, I'd assume. So whoever out there got those gum bottom Air Jordan 1s, congrats, you got us. We're gonna send the money back to the buyer, obviously, and then hopefully USPS works out a claim and sends us like, a hundred bucks. That's usually what happens. Uh, they send us like a hundred dollars because if you don't pay for insurance, that's the max insurance that you'll get. So hopefully they'll at least send us that. It sucks that we sold them for 180 and we're only gonna get back a hundred, but it's better than nothing. So just another bump in the road today. You want cash for this stuff? Uh, if y'all can do cash. All right, cool. How much are you looking for for it? That one, I think I paid like a hundred or something. Uh -huh. And this one I paid like, I got that out of the mall a minute ago. Uh -huh. So I got that for 50. Mm -hmm. and how much were you looking for? Probably 100. Together? Yeah, together. The CDG might just pass just because it's really, really small mm -hmm. and it should be really tough for us to move in here. This one I might just pass also just because the season's changing and the size mm -hmm. and they're going for like about the 50. I think I just pass on both of them. I'll say try other shops. Okay. They'll probably give you that 50 or maybe 40, something like that. I just know for here it'll be tough for us to move just with the season changing and the size and all that. Well, all right, hang on. I appreciate man. it. My fault about that. You guys take last? I could check them out. Let's see. I just want to see. I don't even have to take that much. 
Alright, and you look for cash or trades? Um, I'll probably look around if anything. I'll take the cash. You can, take, you can give me like Zelle. I mean, um. Yeah, we do like Zelle, PayPal. Uh, Zelle, Cash App. I'll take one of those. Alright, cool. Okay. And how much were you looking for for this stuff? Or you had it individually? Um, I don't know. It's like no, no SNL or ballpark where you're trying to give everything? No. Alright, cool. Oswego's and stealth. Uh, these two. Two, yeah, I'm gonna be far off. Ray Allen's. 144. Yeah, and we'll have ice. Probably just like 80 so. Yeah, same, we're probably gonna be far off because without the Oswego's, I came up to 150 for these three the stealth, the Ray Allen's, and the guava ice. And if you want to store credit, I can bump it up um, a little bit more. If you wanted to do these, I was at two. Uh, that's um, 250, 150 for the three J's. Uh, I do the 250. We'll do a 250. All right, cool. Yeah. Check them both out. Just make sure they're good. Uh, like you're just trying to exchange it. Like I know folks. It should be able to it. All right. There we go. Appreciate you guys. Thank you very much. How are we going? You too. How are we going? Shout out to those guys for coming and cashing out and selling us some things. First up here, we have some guava ice. Got to clean it up a little bit, but again, all stars. So should sell around like 100 ship, 120 ship. Not a bad shoe. Some rafts, Mazwigos. Um, these used to do really well back in the day. They're still holding up pretty well, actually. Let's see what this person is talking about. Top shelf. Hello, I have a pair of Jordan 10 on back, and they're in perfect condition. The only thing wrong with them is the bottom. They're a little dirty. What ten is it? Yeah, I'm back. Okay. Uh, shoe. Sh you shoes we have to see in person, so I say bring them in and we can take a look at them. Alright. Alrighty. Yeah, thank you. No problem. I'm going. Stealth threes. This shoe is a weird shoe because back in the day, the shoe was like crack for most people. Like I don't know how it did well. No creases though. A little star loss, but again, I think it's gonna be a good shoe. Probably sells for like 120 ship. And then the last shoe are the Ray Allen sevens. Again, the bottoms are dirty, but again, everything else is pretty clean up top. No severe creasings or anything like that. Paid 250 for everything. Let's see what this other person is talking about. Top shelf. Hey, how's it going? Uh, you guys have a pair of Yeezys in a size eight and a half. Uh, the Quantum Basketball on eBay. Well, I shot you guys an offer last week, and then you guys shot back a counter offer. Uh, it just fell out. You know, I got busy with work. I couldn't accept the offer. If I shoot you guys an offer again, you know, can I just get at the price you guys offered me? It's like 165 for the size eight and a half Quantum Basketball. How much do we have it uh, listed up at? You have it up at 200 uh, for 150 You guys came back with 165 I would say, yeah, like just offer again. I don't remember the offer, to be honest. Maybe my boss did. I say just offer it again, like the 165 If that's what we countered, if that's what we countered, then we're most likely accepted. So if I, if I put the offer in, how soon will it, you know, will we get to take a look at it? Probably as soon, because we just took stuff to the post office. So I would say as soon as my boss comes back and he wants to drop the stuff off, I'll let him know about the offer. By the time he gets back and I let him know and everything, he probably should accept it pretty fast. Probably have the shoes out by later today or tomorrow. All right, no, thank you so much. No problem. And are you local? I'm in Brooklyn, but I'm going to have them shipped to uh, my family in northern New Jersey. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Excellent. No problem. Have a good one. The sales are rolling through. We just sold a mid one wolf gray blue, size six. All right, sounds like a good sale to me. And then, as we were packing earlier, we saw some stuff just waiting for some payments for the buyers to pay. But... Boom, Aqua 8. Probably spoken about this shoe a million times because I just love this shoe so much. I just like the 07 pair better because I don't like the dark gray. I like the black better. But again, I really do love this shoe. I think it's an underrated shoe. It's so for a pretty good price. So whoever bought this shoe got it for a really good deal. Again, you see the sparkles and everything. Still intact. Really good shoe. Then this shoe that just came in on Saturday, literally like around like five or six, the Travis Scott British Khaki. I really like this shoe. I didn't like it at first. Again, Again, that's with me with a lot of shoes just like the union force but this shoe is really really clean like if you can tell like he barely wore them maybe like one time if that so like pretty clean shoe check the market on these you can't really find used pairs of this shoe like that so yeah when it's up there for a pretty good price you gotta jump on it so yeah shout out to the person who bought this shoe we're gonna get it boxed up and the mail is gonna come by later so yeah top shelf what's up man um did you guys get any uh off-white dunk lows in the 10.5 uh, no, nah, sorry, we did not. Not yet, okay. Just checked back. I was in last week. Uh, all right, work. Thanks, man. Yeah, no problem. Just keep calling. Top shelf. Yeah, I was just calling to see if you got the open. Yeah, we are. Uh, you still purchase the spaces? Uh, we buy all the time. All right, now I'm just going to make sure if I can help you. All right, bye. Yep. No problem. How are we going? I was in common down in mind because I, mean, I never get what I want. <laughs> <laughs> 
this is where it stopped. Well, well these two are just basketball shoes. Jubilees that stop? Yes, sir. Uh, cool. How much do you look for, for Jubilees? 280. 280. And then the two uh, basketball. I was hoping maybe one for the Georges, uh -huh. maybe 80 for the Giannis. Honestly, though, I paid 220, 120, and I paid 85 for these. So at least I'd like to come out with a little sign sign. And I break you. even, I won't cry either. But. I could do 100 here. So that's at 220 and 100. That's 320. Can you give me an even four for all of them? Because 220 kind of hurts me. I mean, I've been sitting on them and that's what I got, so I won't get shit on them. No, I feel you. You know what I'm saying? This one, this is just the one that kind of like worries me just because, like I said, they're all over the place. I'll hold on to these. You said one you said and 320. Two, for these. One and 220, yes. Yeah, I could do that. You could do 340, just more so for these. You know what I mean? I do 330. 333, give me an angel number. I won't even go to 335. 33. I think 330. Jubilees don't really sell that well for us. Really? Yeah. Flip it for the 35 and the 30. Coin flip. Maybe 330 and 335. Yeah. Coin flip. Come on. It's America. 50-50. I'll Look at that. Chin chin, you heard it. Y'all trying to your side, man. I'll do 335, 325. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> I respect that. You want to do that? Respect the bitch. Uh, I'll be pissed. <laughs> I mean, you want to call or you want to flip? Hey, man, I'll let you call it. You're the away team. Oh, I can't even knock that. I didn't mean, want to call it. I wanted a flip. <laughs> All right, call in the air. Call in the air. Heads. Hey, hey. Damn, yo, take that off camera. Take that off camera Tell. right now. Tell. I think the ground's tilted. <laughs> the 325 it is. Sound good. How we pay you last time? On um, Venmo, but I don't have Venmo. Okay, do you have? I think I have Zelly. Zelly. Well, cash would be my number one if you could. Do you have Apple Pay? Nah, Apple Pay, look at me. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you got yeah, Andrew, I'm, yeah, I'm Andrew. a laborer, man. All right, all right, all right. Let, me, let, me, let me see. Are you ready? Yeah, he sent it to you. Oh shit, boats and hoes. Oh, Chase, Aaron. Okay, yeah, I think I even got the alert for a yeah. from Chase directly. Yeah, you should get, the t you usually get a text yeah, yeah, I get exactly. a text message when someone zelled me. Yeah, he shorted me 10 bucks. <laughs> Pissed, I'm gonna lose sleep over that. Hey man, maybe next time you'll win. I'm gonna come over with a double headed coin, I'm flipping. <laughs> <laughs> guys, guys, guys. For some more stuff for my hoopers out there, basketball season is almost around the corner, almost. NBA season, almost there. Paul George, get your bucket. Yeah, the PG3 NASA's. I think we have a couple pairs. I may be wrong. Paul George, her is a good ball shoe. I prefer Kyrie's. Size 11, so anybody who needs basketball shoes, we have a size 11 in PG's. And then the 25 anniversary also the jubilees size 10 and a half a good shoe i like this shoe it's not a top 5 11 but it is a decent all black shoe if you're selling out there who's looking for an all black shoe or a majority black shoe so that you have like an everyday use this is a good shoe cleaning up some of the shoes that came in earlier today got some stuff to take flicks of we didn't talk about the unlvs that came in earlier the four hours shout out to her she brought in a size four used unlv got some Kyrie, some air forces bordeaux sixes and size seven and a half some five red five prestos usa prestos so we got some stuff that's going to the ebay and also we just put up a shitload of stuff on our ebay probably about like a hundred items probably like a good amount of items we just listed on the ebay and we have a lot more on the way so it is two o'clock only two o'clock and business is going going pretty well so far like i said i got more stuff to clean get up on the ebay and let's see what the day holds I'm just giving off a free so if y'all want to take any size you got jerseys like spring it up, I've been everywhere. Literally. What's your brand called? Seven Clothing. The SBN CLO. I had a pop up, so I had mad stuff. So I'm just trying to like network with people talking. Word. What size do y'all wear? I don't know if you have 2X. You only wear 2X? Yeah. Man. <laughs> I mean, the XL looks like it would fit. I don't want to like take it just to take it. Nah, nah I, I just, I prefer if y'all just take it. I'm not really on the like, I was going to buy some shoes too or something, but Word. I could just take it. Like, I mean, Wow, you make those yourself? Yeah, that's pretty, pretty awesome. Hard. If y'all don't wear it, give it to y'all fam friend. You mean? Oh, for sure. I know y'all don't want to take all that, but whatever y'all don't want. So you print all this stuff yourself and like? Yeah. Really? That's dope. Man. That's and so you're ready to show them? Yeah. Are How you want to pay? No, these um, are used. Is that? Is that? Alright, that's cool. I'll give you the number right now. You want a bag? Um, yeah. yeah. Uh, we are all good. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Sure. SBN CLO, seven clothes in seven days is all we need. I mean, that's the brand. Where can find New Jersey. You? Find me Instagram, E Simmons Jr. Seven. Business brand is SBN CLO. Very simple. Check me out. Feel me? Yeah. What you looking for? Brand new though. Never one. You looking for two something for these? Look cool. 
Yeah. 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 Alright, cool. I'm gonna do that. Alright, uh, what's the best oh, yeah. way? Uh, Venmo, Zelle, right. PayPal, Apple Pay. You don't do cash out, right? Nah, no, no cash out. Send it to your, uh, your Apple Pay. Yeah. You send it to you? Yeah. Alright, cool. Yeah. You all good? Yeah. Alright, cool. Perfect. I appreciate you guys. See you, bro. Yes, sir. How much you want for these? Uh, two. You want two for two. these? Alright, cool. Yeah. Right now? Yeah. Alright, cool. And how much for the, um, I mean, for the grade schools? I'll probably pass on the pre on the grade school, but I could do the two here for the um, size 10. Uh, you got no offer for you? Nah, 150 is just more than what they're going for. They're going for uh, 120. What's the best way to pay me? It don't matter. I can let you know. Memo, Zelle, PayPal, Apple Pay. All right. We're back, got a little hectic. This is some sales that sold. Here we got the Scream Green Hirachi. Probably like one of the best, if not the best colorway for the Hirachi run. Here we got the He Got Game 13. One of the best, if not the best colorway of the Air Jordan 13. And then we got a weird Jordan 1 mid. I'm really happy about this sale because we have so many just random mids on our eBay store. So when they start selling for around market price, I get happy. So these are three pairs that we gotta pack up and get shipped out. Hopefully the mail lady comes later to pick all this stuff up. We're taking pictures of a bunch of stuff but just to everyone who just pulled up and bought some stuff made a few sales but 13s just came in by 10 need them we got them i got a full size run to be honest yeah we got a lot of flint 13s man that's a good one that's a classic that's creepy that's our third different 13 to sell today. The Lucky Green, the Red Flint. He got games, and then we just got wow. in a Blue Flint. Why are 13 so hot all of a sudden? Like you said, fall time coming up. High tops. Protect the ankles. High tops. You know, I just had some breakfast. Everyone's probably about to eat some breakfast. Got a lot of content to work on. Got packages to pack. Stuff to take pictures of. And yeah, see what happens. And then I got some wave runners. I don't know if you'll take them. I nah, would we'll take them. How much are you looking for for this stuff? Um, if I could do like at least a little bit of cash today, normally I would say uh, we could just do PayPal because usually that's what we do. Oh, you like you want cash, cash? I got yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like if we could do maybe like a half cash or something like that. All right, cool. I got those on the original drop. Mm. I was thinking about wearing them, but. They're a little too wild for me. Yeah, it's a little. They're cool though. I was trying to get six for the guavas if I could. Six and for the guavas. Let's say. What's going on, man? I need to bring some sneakers before I buy. Uh, you have a lot? Yeah. Um, I would say, is that your is that your uh, Mercedes right there? No, I'm right here on this side. My wife's uh, in the car. I was going to say, uh, if you got a lot of stuff, I'm park right here, here, unload it right here, and then go find parking. Okay. You either park in Calandra's or on the corner right here on, um, at the bank. Or maybe, I don't know. Or for like a thousand. Let's try to do like a G. Yeah, for both. I don't know cool. if that's you know, legitimate. I know you said like a G. Yeah, it's I was at, Can we be at like 925? So where you at? Uh, is this 6 I was at, at like 525 and like 350. Can you do 950? 935, meet you in the middle. It's 5 bucks. You want to do 40? Can we do 40? <laughs> Alright, we'll do 940. All right. um, probably had no cash though. Okay. That's the only problem. Can I get like any kind of guy? I was going to say we like... could probably sell it. That'll go straight to your bank account. Yeah. What bank do you have? Bank of America. You should have, yeah, yeah. you should have Zell. Right, let me look. Are these all used? No. They're all used, yeah. All right, cool. Oh, and you're looking for cash to trade for all this stuff. Cash. All right, cool. And how much were you looking for? A thousand. A thousand? All right, see what we do that. Six hundred for everything. Can you meet me halfway at seven? Probably do like six twenty-five. Six fifty and we go. And I got Zell. <laughs> uh six fifty is cool. Close to six fifty, right? Yeah. yeah. I was working on some stuff. Jordan was buying a bunch of good stuff, negotiating all that stuff. Sold a few things. One thing being this beautiful DeMar DeRozan Kobe. I honestly think this is going overseas to Australia, I believe. So shouts to Australia if it is going there. This sneaker's crazy. DeRozan's definitely a good baller. You know, he doesn't get the respect he deserves. He's on the Chicago now, right? So, you know, we're going to see what he does over there. It's going to be an interesting team. Lonzo Ball, DeRozan, Zach Levine. Playoffs? Got the great white height or the great white hope. Who's that? Alex Caruso. Oh man. Cut it out. Put some respect on Come on, put some respect Cut it out. Name. Another guy that LeBron turns into a star. All LeBron does is turn people into stars. You could be in a wheelchair and LeBron will get you a deal <laughs> next year. Anyway, these DeRozans are heading out. We're gonna pack these up. Throw in Panta, all those packages ready to go. Shout out to the mail lady who said she's coming by today. I hope she does. So we're gonna pack all this stuff up, get it all ready, and see what else happens.
all right we got some orders going out these orders all just came in first up we got this very nice new jersey nets jason kidd jersey sadly it's a youth this one is heading out to texas so shouts to texas next up we have a pair of new balance new balance obviously has been getting a lot more popular lately this pair is heading out to new york shouts to new york comes with the cream blue laces little cream on the midsole and last up how you guys doing iterate orange peel where are these heading authentication in las vegas so west coast so we're gonna get these three packed up and see what else happens we're Right. Anyone pick cash for it? Any new back? Yeah. I could text 9426 if you yeah. like. Yeah. Oh, I, Thank you. Appreciate it, bro. Oh, yeah. How much is it? Uh, what did it say? 200? I don't remember. I think 200. Yeah, 200. Thank you, sir. I, mean, I am looking to sell them, but I also kind of wanted to get your opinions on them because some of them are more beat up than others. Well, what are you looking for them? To be honest, I'm not exactly sure. I know about some years a little bit. When it, so comes, to these, say, when it comes to these old ones that are these beat up, yeah. I was kind of looking to get more of your opinions on them. Look on eBay, see roughly what they're going for. They're all pretty beat up. These we probably pass on. Yeah, the three so cool. fours we'd be interested in, right. but it really kind of depends on like what you wanted for them because obviously like this one's coming apart a little bit. But you know, there's beauty in them being so beat up and nostalgic but it kind of just depends on the price yeah so i didn't really even want to touch them at all because i didn't want to damage them or anything before i had you guys look. where'd you get them my cousin who passed away he had 2004 oh man had, sorry to hear got that. a bunch of stuff passed down it just kind of depends on what you're looking for for them right yeah like i've done a little research but like like i said with these old ones like this it seems to vary like a crazy amount yeah so on, like, little thing so it's kind of hard for me to get like, a real tell on what exactly they should go for it's kind of like a hit or miss type of thing man because they're beat up you know what yeah, i mean yeah, so it's like yeah that's kind of why these ones i was kind of like i'm looking to sell but like you said i don't i don't have a real exact price on them yet because i've seen too many different things i know they're yeah they're beat up you have ebay and stuff like that i don't have it set up yet so like yeah. i'm just kind of going into these sneakers that i've gotten from him like i'm just kind of starting to yeah i mean to i would say that might be your best bet if you want to go yeah. through that hassle and process like throw each one up and see see what's going on so i also have um i have two pair of sbs that are in like pretty good shape i think maybe they've been put on but i think they're okay but they're from that time i know one of them pretty cool so i'm gonna bring those two back in these yeah. i'm gonna I, clearly i gotta do more is there like on. anything you you like want to sell them really, for you're kind of really just like trying don't to know. get a, so like approximation I, and value of them it was really a combination like i am looking to sell them but at the same time i, I want to get like want to figure out like what they're really worth before i just sell them for some price okay like cool. i know these ones i mean they got a little paint rip but i would assume know. if you threw those on ebay you're probably looking at on a good day two out of assume they're probably going for and less then, than that these so two probably like 75 ish each on a good day after fees so like these ones are beat up and these ones are beat up yeah but i know these ones they never released again like, they released them once again but it's still a classic so you know it's a good the shoot. other thing though is i think maybe something but they're coming apart okay yeah but so like if you brought them it. to a store they'd probably make you an offer of somewhere like 100 for all three maybe a little more right you put them up on ebay yourself like i said 75 ish after fees 75 ish if you're lucky Right. and then like 150 so you're probably looking at hopefully 300 i definitely just gotta look into it more yeah no, for sure. and if you want to bring the but other the stuff SPs, in they're in bring it in. shape so yeah, yeah. If, you want yeah. Me to, if you want to check up would you be interested i mean in like i don't know you gotta just uh bring them yeah. in we can see how much you, right. you're looking for for them so i do know a little bit more about these for the conditioner prices I've seen. okay do you have a price in mind of what you're looking for for them at all it's like again it's still hard because they, they really vary i know those are the takashi americanis these i don't know if they've been born these are i forget what these are called but i looked up right before i came and they were more valuable than i thought they were so like i said the prices vary so i'm just trying to see you offer. tell me bro like yeah. tell me what you what you want well, it's you. Tough. i know you're, you're talking about you see prices so tell me what you see tell me what well, the prices take. i see i don't just don't want to sound crazy because like i said you i don't sound I crazy man especially you can hear it all so um like the twin peaks i saw going for like over 200. okay so what would you want for them like i said it's tough probably haven't done enough research on them but okay sure. like i said I, I i did check everything out right before i came just get like so you said these are going idea. for like two or a little more than two right yeah somewhere okay. around above two is these like, guys these so i know like these again like i don't know how sought out these are but when i looked them up i did find some pretty good prices not compared to these other three these other three from what i saw seem to actually have some value. yeah these these honestly we probably only yeah take those, <laughs> yeah like, on the low end yeah i kind of um, yeah these guys what did you see them all three of these were 
seem to be going easily over 200 in good condition. I don't know exactly. These ones seem like they've been worn. It's kind of hard for me to tell. It seems to like vary very specifically by like very small things. So it's hard for me to put like an exact price. I know the Mar Marikamis were going for some decent money. So. so what would you be looking for for the stack here? What you what you'd want for them? I mean, you could throw these in too. It's just these like, I don't no, know. Yeah, no, no. That's why I just, I figured I'd bring them in because they- Well, you know what? I mean, we, we'd want them all. It yeah. just kind of depends because it is a good size price. for us, 13. Yeah. Two hours later. It seems like maybe, because you keep asking me the price and I really, okay. I, I don't know as much as I would want. I like to you. give you like a price straight up where I was like, this is what I need for them. I clearly don't know that. I am looking to sell these okay, for cool. like uh, good prices. That doesn't need to be right now because clearly I don't know exactly what I want for them. Okay, but cool. that's why I, like I said, when I came in, I was looking to hopefully get like a little insight. I know you guys are looking to make money too. So I'd assume we'd probably be in the 350, right? 400 range for all four. For all four. Something like that. Yeah, I mean, I would definitely have to look into it more, but I know you guys are trying to make money but like the Marikamis were seem to be going for like a decent amount. Okay, I understand. Like, like fly, I was on Flight Club. Flight Club only has them certain sizes. So like it seems like I'm gonna have to get the specific sizes and prices, I guess. So what do you want for those? Seem, I just really okay. don't know. So yeah, I don't know why we're, we're kind of like negotiating for no reason then if you're not like sure what you uh, yeah, want. My, <laughs> what my, you my, want, well, what I mean, you want that's why. That's why want. I said when I came in, I wasn't exactly sure. So I was okay, okay word, yeah. Like, I know at the same time you guys were trying to make your money, so you're not, yeah, gonna, I mean, not gonna give me all the information, I, I guess. No, I mean, open up a store you can sell these for whatever you know what i mean like that's the thing you gotta have an ebay account you gotta have a store you gotta have some type of path to sell it no um, yeah, so sure. obviously for if you sure. want to do that but there's for no sure. like secret to it other than that like we have an audience to, no, to yeah. buy the stuff no yeah for sure that's um, why i just like i said like i, I don't know the specific yeah you're right I, I didn't mean to come in here and waste your time no i, I mean like that's what i'm yeah. doing i definitely didn't i didn't mean to do that yeah, just, it's, it happens bro i'm just trying to get like a you yeah. know we're trying to buy the shoes because i thought you wanted to sell them but if you don't if you're not sure just do some research bro and yeah, for um, sure. probably I think I'm, I'm probably just gonna have to do some research. Yeah. I, I feel bad. I didn't mean to come in. No, nah, it's totally fine. Anything. But um, I'm saying like what, like just to know, like two, four, six, eight. Like you want eight hundred? Like what do you? Um, you know what I'm trying to say? Like what do you? Well, yeah, just because like being from what I saw, like I would probably want like like I said, clearly the ones I don't know enough about. You said you might not even want them, but like the other two, like I would probably want like three. But like I said, that okay. might sound crazy. That's why. Like, no, I it did, doesn't sound crazy. That's um, why I didn't want to like. Throw but like you said, you you see them going for two two fifty, so that would be tough for us to pay that because right, that's exactly. roughly what they're that's, at. Why, that's why I didn't want to how think. about about 500 for all four I just feel like I got to think about yeah, it no worries, bro. I, like, oh, yeah, go think about I clearly it. don't know like enough which I shouldn't have came in here yet but like no nah, dude my it's, bad. yeah I um it's all good man. but yeah I was definitely I was trying to get some insight you definitely gave me some so I appreciate yeah, it yeah no problem um, I'll probably be back with these if I nah, had to guess no problem I just, bro just, just try just to throw them up online yourself see if they sell and I just want to make sure I make the right decision on them you know what I mean I mean at the end of the day it depends on how you want to do it like obviously you're going to throw them up yourself and try to sell them and sit on them you'll probably make more money but if you bring them to any store yeah, you know I mean, that's probably if i had to guess get. i'm sure I'll, I'll probably be back like this week no no if worries. i had to guess or something yeah, anytime, so. bro. but to give it a I try it. thank Throw you them i definitely uh, i definitely appreciate it yeah anytime bro. my bad for no nah, it's all good bro have a good one thank you man. condition to like decent condition and then like three beaters i'll start with the ones that i got the boxes for first i only have two with the box these are the ones that are the nicest condition i'd say how much you want for those how much do they go for no uh, new doesn't really matter with these yeah. No price in mind for these? Not yet. Just trying to listen to offers. What's the other shoes you have? These are the others that I said were like pretty good condition. Just don't have the box for them. They're the French blues. These two, these two tens, these are the ones I said are like decent condition. Mm -hmm. This bag is just the beaters. That's cool. Yeah, you can just take them out too. All right. And are you looking for cash or trade? I don't know. Depending on what you got, maybe trade. Mm -hmm. But if not, then I will take cash. I want to see like how much I'm playing with first. Yeah. yeah. How much are you looking for for like these? I don't know. I mean, I guess I wasn't really prepared. Three hundred cash, a little more store credit range for all this stuff. Kind of the beat up stuff we wouldn't really want, but if it's like all coming together, we might. Yeah. Have, you know what I'm trying to say? Yeah. Like how much for the aquas and these? These were the nicest condition, and the aquas. Uh, where were you at on the aquas? Like 150, so a little less. 225 for the aquas and the blues. Yeah. Can you do 230? Well, how much you want for everything towards those shoes? I mean, we said we were at three. Those are at five. I mean, you tell us kind of what. I would be willing to spend like an extra hundred cash. Um, that would be tough. Like maybe 400 store credit for everything, and then I 
pay at 100 for the balance for those two? We could probably come up to like 330 and it'd be like 170 Or if you wanted one pair and then we add cash on top, try to work that out as well. Which one's cheaper? Win like 82? Yeah, I believe so. Trade you all these for 350 store credit and then pay 150 for these two. If not, I'm gonna have to just get one pair. Let's go with me though. Oh, yeah, that's, that's cool. That sounds good to you, that sounds good to me. As long as the 150 sale Venmo or yeah, uh, something yeah. like that. Yeah, I got whatever. First, yeah, he'll bring out the other one so you can check him out. Yeah. The other here is at 275. He wanted to know if he bought all three, what's the best we can do? 250, I guess. So probably, uh, where we at, already five for both. Yeah. So it'll be 550 for all three. No, it would be, uh, 750. 750, my fault. 750. I think 750 is pretty fair to be honest. 740? 750. Coming from shopping in a mall store where they're charging you $300 for Air Force One that's going for 180. Is coming, it really? Yeah, you're coming here, you're getting shoes that are going for 280, 350 at their store for 250. It's like, yeah, kind of the best you're going to find them for. You know, you're trying to be as fair as possible. But I think I want all three though. I think I'm going to do 750. How oh, you so want to pay the have, remainder? How do you guys want to get paid? Uh, Probably Venmo, Zill. I have Venmo. Yeah, that's yeah, we cool. Can do Venmo. 400. Yeah, because you said 350 on top. It was originally 550. I mean, 500 for the shoes, which was, uh, he owed 150. So it should building. be 750, take away 350, so 400. Yep, here's the scan codes. All right. Just by curiosity, Perfect. if I didn't buy any sneakers, how much cash would I have walked out with today? Probably three. 300. Yeah, Word. if that, maybe a little less. Word. Yeah, stuff like this is tough, man. Like It's just, it's beaters. Yeah, you know. What do you guys do with the beaters? Did you guys try to restore them? No, probably sometimes 99 cent auctions. Really? Throw them up for like 50, 60 bucks. Sometimes kids see them on our website and they'll come in and say, hey, like I saw you have these for 50 bucks. And they'll buy them. Sometimes people will buy them to restore, like work on their restoration skills mm -hmm. with them. That really depends. Uh, do you need bags for those? Yes. Yeah, I got you. I do. Thank you guys for the hookup. Yeah, anytime, sure. man. Appreciate Have a good one, man. It. Have a good one. Have a nice night. Up here with a bunch of beaters, Laney's, Fire Reds, Chicago 10s, Powder Blue 10s, and Aqua 8s. A bunch of other stuff. It was an interesting day to say the least. We got a lot of work done. We sold a bunch of stuff, which is always good. What else happened? That's about it. That's all I can think of. That's about it. Kind of one of those days. Start off the week. Football's coming soon. I'm excited for that stuff. I'm excited to get all this stuff online. Shouts to the post lady for stopping by. She picked up all of our packages. So if you ordered something, it is in the mail. We have a couple other things to drop off at UPS tomorrow. But we will handle that tomorrow morning. Not much else, really. I guess I'll get the old man one and done from over here. Till next time. Peace out. <laughs> Just such a <laughs> YouTube, what is good? Today is September 8th, it's Wednesday. Got a few orders going out today. If you guys saw the flea market video, you would know that I just bought the Big Bangs and they're already gone already, so that's pretty cool. Air Max 96, I think this is going out to the West Coast. Now, I don't really like this shoe, but I like the colorway though. One of my favorites out of all the sales, Iowa Dunks. I really like this shoe. I think the quality is really nice on them. I think it's really slept on, but shout out to uh, Cedric who caught these. It's a really good buy. Sneaker Con Chicago is this weekend. I just found out literally on my way here so i'm guessing this is why these hats so you know the winter chicago bulls sherper fitted hat and then this chicago bulls hat with the um the nba trophy championship trophy in six years that they won the championship shout out to the dude who bought these i think might be this episode two or earlier called yesterday actually and he said he made an offer and we countered but he forgot because he's on business trips so shout out to him for um picking these up and get them shipped out today eat USA Olympic pimping with the number eight on the back. Pretty smoked, but again, not that bad. I feel like this is a really, 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 really good winter shoe. I don't like navy, but again, this is a nice shoe. These ugly Nike ducks. I don't even know the name of these, but these are hideous. But again, fall time is approaching, so I'm guessing that this is why he sold. Oh yeah, we got a couple more. These are bills. I think we bought the whole pack, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, this was a weird sale. Look at it, CP3s. I don't think CP3 really had any good basketball sneakers to me. I do like the elephant print, the green elephant print, but again, I think CP3 has bad Jordan brand sneakers. That's just me. We have this 4X brand new with tag Jordan hoodie. You can see, you got, you got MJ and the threes, and the white cement threes, EM in it, and then you got, I can't really tell what this is, on the side, and then you have the Nike Air. So this is a 4X. I think the dude who bought this also bought these. Size 14, University Gold, 9s. I think 
crazy thing about this shoe is the size. Size 14 surprisingly started doing well for us. You know, usually we used to pass on like a size 14 just because we, I felt like we didn't have a market for it. But lately with just YouTube and everything like that, a lot of people been asking for size 14s. Pretty good shoe to go out for a good price. You gotta take some pictures of that stuff over there that came in last night. Fresh Blue 7s, Powder Blue 10s, Laney's, some really, really clean aquas, Smoke Fire Red 5s, some Mid 1s. Go get the stuff packed up and hopefully get it um, shipped out today. 610. 610? Yeah, 610. The 2. So I'll drop it to 335. Gotcha. Check these in. Make sure they're good. Yeah, they look real clean to me. With the cars, it's gonna be 628. 620. Yes, yeah, so you couldn't just, you can't just do 610 even for me? Oh, uh, I couldn't just because they're 3% free. That's why. So I dropped the shoe to 335. And the 350. Then we had these at 275, which is 610. And then the 3% free. That's the only thing. The 3% free takes out like $18. Alright, no worries. And then would you like back? Uh, yeah, what? And would you like an email, text, or print receipt? Uh, print, please. Print, you don't want cool. Yeah, no problem. So. Hey, you know, man. That's all, man. How are you doing, all right? Ah, uh, you too, people. But individually, like 55 and then 125. One, like, once? Yeah. And I still have the other ones in there, too. Yeah. So, uh, how much you say you went for the Animax? 55. Uh, what's the low should do here? I mean, do you have like kind of an offer to? I mean, okay. these are honestly pretty low because they're going for 170, 160 new. I feel like the lowest I could do is probably like 100. Yeah, I think 100 might just pass from that. How like, about 80? Could you do 80 on those? Uh, originally I was at 60. Could you do 70? And what's the low should do here? Probably like 40, so 120 for both. So you kind of do 70 here? Yeah. I could do 100 for both, so 70 and 30. I feel like that's just a little too low. I feel like these are brand new, 100, and these are going for. I said 160, 170. Did you do 110? Probably stuck at the 170 because I came up. You said 170, so I did a 170. Now I'll do 30 here. Like I said, this is going to sell for 100 because they're like going for 100 new. So just keep those and sell them. Okay, I'll sell those. And uh, I'll say sell these on your own if anything. Yeah. You definitely get more. Let's see if we have cash for you. If not, demo is usually best. Okay. Oh, got it? Mm -hmm. Thank Alrighty. you so much. No problem. Have a good day. So he just traded in some port purples, or I like to call them the metallic purples. Purple. Give them sending for these. These are not really doing any numbers. They're going for under retail, but again, they're pretty clean. I don't really like this shoe. But again, it is a really, really clean shoe. Like no creases, really. Stars all there, no hail drag, nothing like that. So we're gonna flick these up. Don't have to clean them. Get them up on the eBay, and hopefully they sell within a week. I'm calling a week. I think a week they're gonna sell. I'm optimistic. I got a bunch of sneakers here that's been sitting in my closet. Mm -hmm. I figured y'all could use them more than me. Okay. So I just wanted to see what we do. Okay. They're all lightly used. And it's the only one I have that don't have the right box. That's cool. These two I'm contemplating. It's okay. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with my phone. Now you go, bro. Don't do this in Travis's. Cool. So for this stuff, how much are you looking for? Do you have it total or like individually? Like those, maybe like in the 175 range. Mm -hmm. For these, maybe 275, 250, something like that. Mm -hmm. Blue moons, what are you thinking? Blue moons. What size are those? Uh, these are a 11. 11. Blue moons, I was at like two. I was at like 120 here, 100 here, and I'm doing these right now. Say so how much? One. Wow, well, 120 here, 100 here, two. 200 there, and I'm doing these right now. So for the pine greens, at least three. I came up to 820. 820? Yeah. For everything besides uh, the storm blue. And Travis. How much you doing pine green? Pine green, I was at two. And then you said those two are maybe? Yeah. There's some definites that I definitely want to give up. Yeah, see what shoes you want to give up first. And I think that would be like the best thing. Because I know you said there's some shoes you want to fence on. See what you want to give up. And then we could get like a guaranteed price for those stuff. Alright, but so one, the old red, pine green. Uh huh. That's definite three. Five. You said how much? I'll let 100 here. My four. I'll let 100 here. I think you did 100 for the red. I'll do 100, 120. That's 320. That's like two for here. So it'll be 520. Storms, blue moons, and the traps are the last shoes. I believe. And those. Oh, yeah, yeah, the yeah, four yeah. Labs. These are other How much was that for these? I gotta double check that. I think I said 100 for those. So that would be 620. So those are the definites. We'll probably stick with the definites. We might end up still doing them in the later date. You would do everything besides the both blue ones and the trash. Six, six, uh, six. What was the number for these you said? I was at three. Three trash. So 625. 625 for everything? Mm-hmm. Couldn't do 650. 635. 640, good. Yeah. <laughs>
Uh, yeah, 640 is cool. Alright, I'll take the 640. How we paid last time? You gave me cash, but yeah, whatever, cash. whatever was best for you. You got PayPal, cool. Venmo, Apple Pay. Apple Pay is cool. Alright, can we Apple Pay you? Yeah, cool. I know Apple Pay 100% works. Alright, uh, got it. You got it? Yes, sir. Alright, cool. Alright, appreciate you. Thank you, bro. Alright, I'm Alrighty, we got a lot of product. Probably about five shoes, I believe. One, two, three, four, five. Five sneakers here. Yeah, he came in two weeks ago and he sold us the Mellow Twos. You know, nine and a half. This size jumped around a lot. You got like nine and a half, ten and a half, eleven. So that variety of things, a variety of sizes. First off here, we have some Raptor Fours. This is not the Drake's signature one. This is the first one. I forgot the name of these when I was looking. Surprisingly, they do go for some bread even used. And to be honest, just a little clean. Clean up right there and they'll be good to go. Another pair of 11 Labs. We have the red pair that I think A got from the flea market, if I'm not mistaken. And now we have the black pair. PSG 5s, this shoe went up in price. I remember I hit this shoe when it released. I hit for retail. And I sold it pretty fast actually because it wasn't doing no numbers. And now it like it's going up. Then last but not least, probably the best shoe here. I tried to grab the other stuff, but he already said you know before we started that those stuff he may not be interested in selling yet. He just wanna see what the numbers looking like, but he may bring them back. But we have some pine green 1.0. Yeah. How much are you looking for for this stuff? I'll just see what they would offer me. You have no price in mind? No. Nah. What about the human race? Same. That's yeah, so how you guys uh, pay um, pretty much the best compared to other stores. So. hope that's true. I don't know. Yeah, it is true, bro. Hmm. <laughs> no price in mind for the human race? No. Nah. Uh, so I'll probably be at 180 for both of these two. Do like 140 and 40, and yeah. films just don't sell well for us. So how much say? 140 and 40. Oh, 140 and 40? Yeah, I got 180. Oh, okay. What are you thinking? 140 is the best you could do on those. Yeah. Can you guys gonna do 250 on these? It's just gonna sit for us. I say throw them up on gold. Can you do 170 on the Jubilees or not? Is it possible? I'd probably be stuck at the 140. Yeah, I'll run the I'll run the 140. So. Oh, cool. You can do Zell if you want. Got it? Yep. All right. Okay, thank How's you. How's it going, man? How's it going, bro? Yeah. They're gonna go under. I'll just keep this and put it on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna put some stickers in the bag for you. Thank you so much. No problem. All right. So, what are you looking to trade for? Red size nine. And, uh, I got to go get that. The eight and a half should be here. I think that's the eight and a half right there. Yeah, good shape for you. It's pretty clean. Yeah. I can get you the other. So what shoe do you want the most? Let me start from there. Uh, I kind of want both. So what do we, you know, um, I got another pair of high school purples right here. So that's off the price or what they're going for. I'm gonna have to be on the retail. I'm gonna do 360 for these. So these new are going for like 345, 350. So how much are they going new? Right now these eight and a half are going 345 new. I'm looking at 380. On the eight and a half? Mm -hmm. All right, I'm looking at the last sale. All right, so new 380. What do you got? 350. I've had 360. Just because look how clean they are. Yeah, yeah, they're clean. They're clean. No, they're clean. No creasing. So. Yeah, yeah, no, no, they're clean for sure. Oh, that's like I'm doing the bread. They're like 415, 775 for both pairs. I'm gonna go through this stuff first. See what we come up to. This small stuff I might just pass on. I know you bought these last time. I pass on these just because they're low. I can see what these to wrap, but considering if this is low. The, the small size part would be low too. What about the Beijing's or the, or the uh, EMPs there, all right? LA's, what are you looking for? 10 over retail, 120? This tough, because that's what it's going for. I'm gonna be honest, all this stuff is probably going for retail, below retail, especially this stuff. I'm gonna be honest, I'm probably under retail on all of it. I'll give you a price. How much under, like, because I got retail on. Yeah, I can't get retail. No, 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 I know, I know. Uh, you know me, I'm not trying to, <laughs> you know me, I'm not trying to milk bricks. <laughs> retail for everything, I got like an 1175, and we're at like seven. You said retail for everything? No, I'm sorry, like 9.15. Yeah. You say we're at like 7.65, so I'm hoping. But I'm not a retail for everything. Right, right, right. No, but, I'm be, but that's, that's a big difference, so hopefully no, we'll no, get that, you know? I agree. Like I said. You know, you know me, bro. I'll be back, so, you know. I mean. 5.50 for everything is a thousand bees. So you don't want these, you need to put these away, right? No. So where are you at for the purple? I think I think I was at like 100 here, like 110 here, 110 here. 110 for these? They're going for 170, 170, 180. That's I said, a lot of stuff I would just pass on. I'm gonna put you on the retail, that's why I'm saying if you have more stuff. I do. <laughs> I mean, if you have better stuff, I'll say just bring those stuff instead, because again, it's gonna be tough with this stuff here. And we're trading like two good products, basically. A bunch of stuff that's gonna sit, or rather like different products. And we're at 6, 6, 6 for this. No, 775. 775. If I was getting 110 a piece, 110, you said for these, right? For 220. No, 110 was the fragment. Eight and a half in the type 10. This one. It was, it was 110. Where are we at with these? So, you want to take those two out. You want to do these four instead. Yeah, just to see. Towards both of them? Or no, one just them? towards the, the, the bread. Just the bread. Right. Yeah, for now. So, I'll do these four for those. And then, you can come back for these. 
Just what do I get for this? What do I get? These two are just too I low. Uh, no, no, it's not even that. It's just these two are just too low. I feel bad just offering you anything. Yeah, I'll like, come back when they win the championship this year, all right? Kentucky? Lakers. Oh, no. Supreme, 1994. Is this recent? Yeah. How much you want for it? Swap. <laughs> Oh, you want that one? I want a small, man. I mean, I just want a small, you know? And this is the only small y'all got in the store. <laughs> I think. Jordan, I just want to make things happen, man, you know? I'm trying to make it, you know? Is it short sleeve? Yeah, yeah, yeah right. it's a short sleeve. So, all right. Yo. Yeah, that's fine. You can swap. On the, on the breads? Yeah, that's all cool. All right, bro? We're good. That's cool. All right. And if you I'm going to I'm I'm grab these, all right? Yeah, and you know, if you want to swap the cream shirt, that's cool also. I think this is the one you asked for. Yeah, these look kind of big. I'm not going to lie, but I'll try them on. Can I try them on? Yeah, let me see if we have a size 12 out here for. Thank you. No problem. Finish the stuff? Yeah, and then, um, you guys still got that ten and a half in the blue Supreme belt. I'll oh, have to check. It's still on the eBay. It still should be there. Be on top check. <laughs> you can say some shit if you want. Hey, man, uh, I'm finally back down here, you know. Boy, changed up the store a lot. I don't even <laughs> think this was here when I first started coming here. It's crazy. You interested in these? Yeah. All right, cool. Let me know what you're thinking. You looking for this guy? I was gonna say like maybe I give you both of these at a hundred on top. Were you pricing? I probably said like five fifty and like four fifty for this. Four fifty here sounds like a lot. I can double check. I came up to eight for both. I was about like four twenty five and three seventy five. You can add two fifty on top, so drop it from eleven fifty to ten fifty. You want to add? Um, 150. Both the Yeah. Is that cool with you? What do you think? That's cool with me. Uh -huh. Cool with him. It's cool with me. Oh, Thank you. Oops. Did you guys want the, the Kyrie jersey? You want the Kyrie? The Celtics? Probably that. That'll probably be tough for us, to be honest. The jerseys, like the older stuff. Let me see, actually. Yeah. Oh, my you don't want it? You got one, don't you? Yeah, I got a black one. That's the second best way to move. It's the best one. Green. I think that's the most wearable one out of all of them. Like the black is obviously like goes with everything, but like that was pretty cool. I, I bought these just because I don't have to touch them. And I got pandas, so I'm mm. gonna get the black one. Another pair. I'm about this. This one's a size eight. Let me get a shoe. I think this shoe's gonna go up a little bit once it gets colder out i remember the shoe dropped last year around november time it was only going for like 350 i remember i got my pair for 350 and then they slowly slowly start to creep up and now that like that 500 mark so my thing with fall time comes when thanksgiving and stuff like that comes around this shoe's gonna jump up a little bit probably like an extra like 25 hopefully 50 dollars and the big one pause charles got six dead stock i think this might be our second pair like 10 and a half or we might have a 10 not much to say about this shoe the shoe does all the talking just look at it it is 545 I probably leave early again today. Today was like a long day, long tiring day. Got a lot of work done. Jordan took a lot of pictures of the stuff that's on the floor. Got a couple orders going out. Some Eric Emanuel shorts, some McDonald ones, a GTA lanyard that's going overseas. And I cannot forget the LA Air Force 2s. Just look at it. I think he bought these from the flea market. I may be wrong. I think Burn bought these. Bought I them almost bought them. Or it wasn't Nick who bought them. One of you guys bought them. But again, good shoe. Going out. Had it for a little bit of time now. Yeah, pretty cool. Around 40. Yeah. I actually might grab this shirt too. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I was waiting for you to grab that one. I actually, oh shit, during this price tag on this, I'm sorry you did. I, could, I couldn't remember it. Like we, <laughs> I haven't had other, this one, so I'm like, I you know seen what? it the other day, and every time I see a Brewstein shirt, I think of you, and then you came in, I was like, is that Brewstein shirt, Springsteen shirt still in there? And then it was there. I was like, ah. Yeah, I have this one yet, so. Yeah, this is a good one. It has a little stain right there. Nah, it's fine. I actually probably can get it out. I might be able to at least. Uh -huh. All right, so it'll be 100. 30 cash, and then put the rest yeah. on them. Yeah, that's cool. Yep, you're yeah, all good. Word. Getting some work done, but we got some orders to go out. And I felt like talking about these, especially Air Force Two Low LA Edition. I've had these for quite some time. They finally sold, so shouts to whoever purchased these. Such a good sneaker. Next up, we got a sneaker that I don't think is such a good sneaker. I think this is called the Ginger Four Premium. I mean, I guess the quality is pretty dang good. Condition is pretty good too. These we've had for quite some time, so I'm glad they finally sold. And then we got these Eric Emanuel shorts plus this Fear of God crew neck, and we have to get 
get a Grand Theft Auto lanyard heading to Australia. So shouts to Australia on that purchase. These are actually really nice quality after I took them out of the pack. Definitely did their thing on those. But anyway, we're gonna get this stuff packed up, shipped out, took pictures of all this stuff that we have to get out of here as well. And we're winding down here. I think another storm's coming in tonight, so hopefully it's not that bad. We definitely don't need any more water, so let's see what happens. Alrighty, it is about 6.05. We are winding down. Today was a really good day, really busy day. A lot of products came in, sold a lot of good stuff. Sold the Supreme Dunk, Legend Blue Low, some Union Mids, some Pollens, some University Blue. Yeah, today was a really good day. Tomorrow's Thursday, it's football season, and we're back tomorrow. Can't wait. Cowboys suck. They're going to lose. I'm taking Buccaneers money line. I'll say they'll win by, I'll give them, um, they'll win by like 10 points. They'll win by like 10 at least. So yeah, catch you guys next time. Peace.